In this video, we will continue with natural logarithms. You will find this on page 411 in the Namibia AS level mathematics textbook y equals mx plus c to success. Let's look at another example. Given that 3e e to the power x plus 8e e to the power negative x equals 14, find the possible values of e to the power x and hence solve the equation correct to three significant figures. Okay, the problem is this negative, okay, negative exponent index. So first, I'm just going to bring it down to make it positive. Now, it's like I want to get rid of this fraction, so I make the denominators the same by multiplying with e to the power x, or well, let's say, let's just say by multiplying with the LCM. Um, so here I multiply e to the power x over 1, uh, multiply e to the power x over 1, multiply e to the power x over 1. So this will cancel. Then I will basically sit there, do you see? So this, I, the bases are the same and I add the exponents. So x plus x will be 2x. This cancel, did you see? And this is 14e to the power x. Okay, now I just take it over. So there is now just positive indices. But it's also a trinomial because this one is double that one. Do you see? And the bases are the same. So I can factorize now. So just focus on your numbers. This is 8, 14, 3. This is in group A. So it's, a, okay, it's, it seems to me it's 4 and 2. Um, it's going to be in group A, so I must add. So if I say 3 and 1. So let's see, um, 3 and 1, because then it will be 12 plus 2, so it's 14. And the signs will be the same, negative, negative. And then it's e to the power x, e to the power x. Okay, uh, so there is my two brackets, basically, which I formed there. And then, because remember, that is your, there will be e to the power x, e to the power x. Then I put this equals 0, and I put this equals 0. And then I take it over and I divide 3. Um, and then and then basically I just put lin on both sides. So remember that will become, that's an E, so that will become 1. So x is lin 2 over 3. And then here the same, if I put lin and I bring the x, then it's lin 4. And then if I simplify it correct to three significant figures, I get, because they ask correct to three significant figures, I get this and I get this. That's my two answers. Okay, I want you to stop the video and I want you to do number 1B. Again, you can continue the video as soon as you are finished. Okay, let's just make it a bit smaller. Then we can start with number B. 1B. Okay, I'm just going to rewrite e to the power x minus 21 e to the power negative x minus 4 equals 0. I just want to say this number a, it was not necessary. You could, you could basically factorize from the start. The same with number b, um, number 2. But this one, because of that negative, you must first do the following, just like the example I showed you. So it's going to be e to the power x minus 20. Oh, let's just get that pen correct. 21 e to the power x minus 4 over 1 equals 0. And then I multiply e to the power x, multiply e to the power x, multiply e to the power x, and actually there also, all the terms. And then I'm getting e x plus x is 2x minus 21 e to the power x. Oh, no, 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 no. Sorry. Because what happens? That cancel. Okay, so it's just minus 21. Then minus 
4 e to the power x, and that's also 0. Okay. Then if I rearrange it, I think it's better if you rearrange it. Okay. And then I'm just going to factorize. So, so this is a negative, so it's in group B. This is 1, so I'm going to subtract. So if I'm going to look at my values there, okay, let's just, let's just quickly see um, what it's going to be. Um, it's going to be 1 and 1 and 7 times 3, yes. Because 7 minus 3 is 4. And then the biggest of a cross product gets the negative, positive, and then this is e to the power x, e to the power x. So I get my two brackets, e to the power x minus 7, e to the power x plus 3, and that is equal to 0. Okay, and then I get e to the power x equals 7, or e to the power x equals negative 3. just want to move this. Oh. Okay, now I put lin on both sides. Now the problem is, if you put lin on both sides, you're going to get a negative lin, which is not going to, to give an answer. So you can also already say, this one is having no solution. So you can basically just continue with this one. Bring the x to the front, because then this is going to become 1, because I'm just going to show you. Remember, Lin is having a base of E, and that's Lin 7. And if I move it up, okay, this is becoming 1, so X is actually equal. This, this is simplified, but if they say correct to three significant figures, I can say Lin 7, they did not. So I think they will also accept this answer, Lin 7. But otherwise, it's 1.94. Uh, no, there's a 5 after, so 1.95. Because that, um, it was actually, can I just show you? It was 1.9459, so that 5 makes that a 5. And that is correct to three significant figures. That's how you do it.